Good morning. This is Pam Bivens in my home here in Lompoc, California. And I wanted to ask you a question real quick. Have you ever heard of Sam Crowley? Now, some of you haven't, some of you have. Sam has a very unique story. And I was privileged to hear it on, on a call since he is within my company. Now, Sam was a big wig in a company. He had the corner office, all these people under him. The only problem was that he worked from before sunset to after sundown. He rarely got a chance to see his kids. And he had little ones at home. And he got this emotional thing going on for his daughter. His daughter wanted it to be Saturday, all the time, because Saturday was the only time that she got a chance to see him. So he did something very spontaneous. He quit his job, bought a franchise, saying, well, you know, there's franchises all over the place, I can do this. Well, he didn't have a plan of where he wanted to go. So, and he didn't have the learning behind him to make it run right. So, unfortunately, he, that failed. And if you've ever looked into a franchise, they are very expensive to start out. So, that failed. He had to file bankruptcy. He went back to the job that he left. And he burnt that bridge. So he went back to that. He went to work as low man on the totem pole under the people that were under him. So if that wasn't a little slice of humble pie, nothing would be. Okay? But he still had his dream. He still wanted every day to be Saturday. So the next question would be something that he came up with. Is the pain of moving forward to your dream? Now, the pain would be the learning curve. You have to learn all this stuff. And the little bit of failures that go along the way to get there. Is that worse than going back to where you were with the brain dead job, the living from paycheck to paycheck, all that stuff? Which one's worse for you? Okay. For Sam, it was worse going back. But he did it. And then he moved forward. Learned what he needed to learn. Kept moving. Had a dream. Went for it. Next question. And then what? Ask yourself that. If you have this nervous thing going on, saying, but what if I fail? But what if? Well, but what if? And then what? Keep asking yourself, and then what? At the end of all the and then what's, you will turn out just fine. You will learn what you need to learn. You will get the skills that you need to, to, to do. And then you get your dream. It's so cool. You might fail along the way. I did. I'm retired now. I'd love to have you get to your dream. Now, Sam is part of the company that I'm with now. He still does his speaking and he does all his stuff, but this is a passive income. And that's what I was looking for. So go ahead, click on the link below. See if this is something for you. If anything, there's a lot of people doing it. And some of the people that you will see doing this, they're no smarter than you are. Honestly, they're no smarter than I was. So definitely click on the link below. See if it's something for you. I, I'd love to see you fulfill your dream. So. You have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video.